we're in this very strange place where there are all these multiverse stories. There are all these stories about parallel universes and the idea of like, of, of like traveling to another universe could be one about escape but I don't think it is. I think it's about understanding that there are other places you can go, but often the places that you, you need to go are actually inward, that, that, that they are actually closer to home than you think. This is a time that we, we are all looking inward, that we all need relationships and family. Even as we dream about other universes, we, uh, uh, the important things are, are, are not very far away, yeah. Chemical Exile is a family drama wrapped up in science fiction disorienting madness. Characters who have, in their own personal way, experienced um, a shift or a time shift or a slipping into a new universe. The show itself is the story of her and other people from other realities as they are trying to get back to their original reality. We have the two camps of Teddy being very analytical and focused on the data, and then we have Everett believing that there is a higher power that is creating all of this madness of the universes. He's come to view these happenings to be more on the miracle side. It also sort of speaks to the epic connections between families across universes that universes can't actually keep people apart, you know, that no matter where they travel and what they do, they always seem to find each other in, in, the, in these places. So Chemical Exile is what we call a psychogeographies project. We started to create during the pandemic as we tried to sort of answer the question of what does the theater do when you don't have a stage and you don't have an audience that can come to a stage. So we started to create these experiences which in multi-chapter narratives would bring people to different locations in the Washington area and they would experience new chapters of an ongoing story. They would receive boxes in the mail with letters and artifacts and each chapter would tell a new part of the story. These seven chapters would culminate in a live performance, and this year the live performance is Chemical Exile Synthesis. It's a dimension of theater that a lot of people don't experience because, you know, this immersive site-specific stuff is not the norm. So much of this show revolves around the audience. The uncommon uses of environment brings part of who they are into the story as much as, as what we tell them. Seeing the audiences interact with everything has really brought so much color to the show. So yeah, I hope that people just have a ball doing something that is not the norm in, in theater.